Hey friend, thank you for tuning back into another video. If you're new here, my name is Femke and I make videos all about product design and research. In today's video, let's talk about questions to ask as a designer in your next job interview. Before you go to your interview, there's a few good things that you want to do first so that you can be prepared and ready to go. The first thing I recommend doing is doing some background research on the company. Reading up about them in the news, going to their website, learning a little bit about what the company is, who they are and what they do. The next thing you want to do is bring your portfolio. Whether it's printed out or digital, make sure you've got your portfolio with you and it's all tidy and ready to go so that throughout the interview in case they ask, you can go through your work. It's also a good idea to print out your resume and hand them out to the people in the interview so they have that in front of them and can look at your past work history during the interview. Some other couple things to do is to decide in advance what you're going to wear. The last thing you want to do is be stressing out just before your interview, trying to decide what to wear and then realizing it's dirty and you've got to find something else. You don't want to deal with that stress on the day, so make sure in advance you lay out your outfit and are prepared for what you're going to wear. The other thing to do is do some research on who you're going to be interviewed by. Hopefully the company has told you who your interview is going to be with, and if so, you can do some research on who that person is. What is their role in the company? How long have they been working there for? Do a quick search online because it's good to know who you're going to be sitting with in the room. And lastly, a couple things I like doing just before going into the interview is to drink some water and have a bit of quiet time. Go to a quiet space, a room by yourself, have a few moments of peace with yourself to get yourself ready and prepared for the interview that's about to come. All right, you've prepared, you're there, you're in the interview, now it's game time. It's likely that they're going to ask you towards the end of the interview if you have any questions for them. Now it's good to have some questions prepared in advance for this moment so you're not caught off guard and trying to think about what you should ask. I like to think of these in advance and then write them down in a little notebook that I bring with me into the interview. That way if I forget the questions I wanted to ask or want some clarification, I can just pull out my notebook and refer to the questions. So what kind of questions should you ask? Well, one question that I think is really important to ask is what are the expectations of this role? You want to get a bit of a sense of what kind of skill set they're looking for. What is this person going to have to do? And you might already possess these skill sets or maybe you don't. And so you want to get an idea of whether these skills are something that you have or that you want to learn and are interested in learning on the job. And another good question to ask is what would my day to day responsibilities be like? And this question gives you a really good insight into what the role actually is. And as you're hearing about this, you can ask yourself, do I see myself in this role? Is this the kind of thing that I'm looking for or that I want? The next question to ask is, what is the biggest challenge for the design team over the next six months? And the interviewer might not be able to give you all the details of this as they might not be able to tell you insider information. But hopefully they can tell you enough to give you an overview and a bit of an idea of what the top priorities are and what the current focus is. So this should give you a good idea about what the kind of work is that you might be focused on on your first six months at the job. Another good question to ask is, how will my performance be evaluated? It's good to know in advance how you're going to be evaluated and how success is going to be measured. Do they set goals? Are you going to be tied to those goals? Get a sense of how they're going to evaluate your performance. I also like to ask, what does collaboration look like here? As a designer, you're often collaborating with other people outside of the design team. It could be engineers, product managers, data scientists. So this is a really, really good question to ask, especially as a designer, to get a sense of who you're going to be working with on a day-to-day -day basis, who those stakeholders are, and who you could potentially be reporting to. One of the most important questions to ask as a designer is what does a career path look like at this company? And this question is key because it shows ambition and that you're thinking about the long term and interviewers like that. So you want to start a discussion around how do they foster professional development? And is there any room for personal growth within the company? You want to get a sense of whether there's room to grow within this company and what your potential career path or long term employment might look like at this company. Another good question to ask as a designer, which sounds really broad, but is a good discussion topic, is what does the product and design process look like at this company? Each company kind of has their own way of how they do product and design. So this is a good question to bring up early so you can get a sense of how the process looks like and whether it's something that matches with your experience and your style 
or is something that you're interested in learning more about and wanting to get that experience. And the last question that I like to ask is a bit more of a direct question to the interviewer, and that is, what do you like the most about working here? And I like asking this question because it takes the focus and the topic away from the actual role, more towards usually they talk about things about the culture or the team. So this is a good question to ask to talk about things outside of the core working role. All right, those are the top key questions that I recommend asking in your next interview. If you have any other go-to standard questions that you ask in your design interviews, then please pop it in the comments so that other people can read them as well. Okay, thank you for tuning in and I will see you in the next video. Bye.